I don't believe we're gonna die permanently. Like whatever we are, that makes us more than just our bodies. You know, our body anchors us here. But whatever we are on the inside, it could just be around us. It could just be floating around. Not some afterlife or a heaven or whatever. It could just be like energy that just floats around us that we can't see or inter interact with. All the dead people and animals and whatever, but all the dead people are just all around as energy. And as we get technology progressing, we can start looking at and seeing the energy and start tapping into it and being like, oh shit, that's, that's my great, great, great grandma right there. And she's been chilling by this tree this whole time. That's crazy. In the future, they can bring you back, right? Because the future, you have all the possibilities in the world open. It's limitless, limitless. In each like decade with technology, we're breaking reality more and more. Like AI is breaking norms of reality. Like, oh, only humans can create art. Nope, not anymore. Who knows how long it'll take, but at one point they'll be able to just tap into like, oh, this is where this energy is, and then bring it back to a different body or a different thing, to, like a machine or whatever, to bring it back. And all this data we give out to companies and to the internet or whatever, that has a better view of you as a person than anyone you know in life. In a thousand years, that data will still exist. As long as we have the internet, as long as we have technology, that data will still exist. Depending on how much you put out there, there will be a full image of you as an entire person, how you grew, how you think, who you were, what you looked like, how you sounded. They can recreate you. AI will be able to recreate you. Just like Caesar, 2,000 years ago, didn't know that there would be like TikToks made about him or filters and like pornos and like films made about him. He had no idea how big you'd become and how much bigger he'll become. Same thing for us. Like we think that just right now in our lifetime, this is going to be it. And then this is it. How, how big of an impact can I make before I die? So my name is remembered. But your name's already permanent. It's already stuck on the internet. You're already out there. And who knows, maybe the internet is just a, a version of what the universe is. You know, it's just us tapping into how the universe already works. It's already interconnected. It's already permanent and sealed. Maybe memories and ideas and our energies and our personalities and everything is already kind of out there. The same way we put a picture out there and it's out there forever. Maybe it's the same with our life. We put our life out there. It's just always out there forever, somewhere. Memories, you can find the memories and just bring them out to you. And maybe it'll be the same for life. We can finally create a technology one day to bring us back from the dead. And then you'll have a planet for each person, an empty galaxy, because like Oprah, you get a planet, you get a planet, you get a planet.